go. Good evening. Well, good afternoon, I should say. I am getting into some more Spooder Men. If you're watching this on Twitch, please consider giving me a follow. If you're watching this on YouTube, waiting. please like and subscribe. And maybe even think about so checking nervous. out the stream. Crystal's mine this time. Into. I've already done this one. Had me stressed for a sec. Crystal this way. Sorry. Maybe it was the other side. Trouble for a little Christmas. <coughs> so I told the cops the someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. No one has seen Marco in years. I would have been there for him if I knew he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. <coughs> that truck's in trouble. Did you guys 
guys know that the bags banks use don't have big dollar signs on them? I know. I was disappointed. Yeah, that'd be very conspicuous. I mean, that wouldn't be very... Uh, they wouldn't be very inconspicuous. They're illegal here without a permit before someone calls the cops on them. Oh, yeah. Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? Hmm? Oh, oh God damn it, guys. Mike! Mike! He's still breathing, but I'll get him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. Ah, where am I? Spider-Man? Don't worry, I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. We, we lost him a few years ago, and... He always loved them, so we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh man, I'm sorry. Spider-Man? Wow. At least I can still wiggle my toes. There. The staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. Hey, just dropped Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. Bro, watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock oh, blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. for your cooperation. Get out of these webs. Good luck to the 
Birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh man. I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Like an accident waiting to happen. Punch it! Spider Man! Take the stake, Spider! Score one for the good guys. Banana bread hummus. Do you have hummus as a dessert? But it was a savory thing usually. Guys, 
felt like they came out of a cult. Better tell Pete about them. <laughs> That's hilarious. You heard of the spectacular Spider Man? We're the subliminal Spider Man! Because our dazzling displays of daring do can't be understood by the conscious mind. But you still get that for Spider Bros. Well, well, well. Spider Man's a shutterbug. Quick, quick. Quick, quick. Yeah. Some things in New York you just can't explain. And that's what's great about it. We really gotta do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? What you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. 
Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. <coughs> you getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. I'm here. <coughs> what am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some <laughs> prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. the gate. Sweet. Can't pull it open from down here. Decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. This isn't the only stash. Uh. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oh, yeah, Miles. 
Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer, Icon. ¿Estás bien? Sí, ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron con some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. Y before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Miles, there's a club there, remember? You on your way? Oh, right! That's today! Mr. Atlas is... confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely! Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. The city seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me.
have to traverse on this game. I think there's a prowler stash nearby. That somewhere else. <laughs> Opened up plenty of these before. Don't mind if I do. There's a prowler stash nearby. There it is. I might have to move that somewhere else. I've opened up plenty of these before. Don't mind if I do. Right. They did come after his tech. Everything good, kid? Got a few unauthorized access attempts from my stash in the shipping yard. Yeah. That group that took Lee showed up. They must be real good if they found it. Even your dad wasn't able to. Dad? Who was the first showdown between Officer Jefferson Davis and Prowler? Had to hide in that shipping container for hours just to lose him. Almost wish he'd caught me right then and there. Never wanted him to get involved. Well, I'm glad you're out of the game now. Stay safe, punk. Same, man. We'll do. You know I left my backpack around here somewhere. Someone totally saw that. Hey, Miles, what's up? Hey, good to see you. <laughs> Man, I can't believe Mr. Atlas is going to be here at BV. 
Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. New reproductive technologies are on the horizon. Check it out on this brochure. We've got preventative contraception information. Please consult your parents and your primary care physician. They'll help you find what's right for you. Yes, those are free. Remember to stay safe. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. She's running late. Presentation's on the main stage. Oh, yeah. I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thanks. See you around. Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisai? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn, but get this. <laughs> it's cake! I'll save you a slice. Hmm, thanks. He made it. <laughs> I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. She must have hit something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words, missing in person. So I'm going to say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. <sighs> Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. <coughs> all right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. The 
Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man. Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Do this quietly. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. But now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi, uh, Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and, uh, thinking. The tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable. Trustworthy. Someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? Don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. I won't let you down. Fascinating. Well, Miles, thanks for your time. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... That could have gone better. Maybe I can make it back to BB in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person and clarify some things. All right, with those guys out of the way, let's see where that tracker signal leads. should lead right to Miss Ferguson's fitness tracker. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. You hide. I've got these guys. involves kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that slide? So tiny in my sight. I dare you, Spider-Man. Come on!
believe it. You took them out by yourself? It's in my job description. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. Consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first. Nice and nice black. Thanks to Spider Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. <laughs> You are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the quad. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So, let's do this right, and meet this week on campus, in person. Okay. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Spider-Man, can you help? Everything okay? Lance, he was kidnapped by Midtown. Don't you guys have like a huge game against them tomorrow? That's the whole point. Look, they explained it in this note. Sound, but you should stay. Pretty sure that note leads to the Stewart building, but we can't access the roof. See why we called you? Yeah, I'll look around. Mm, that RJ kid. I knew not to hold the door for him. Wait, the Stewart building? Wonder why the Midtown kids took Lance there. Did you find him already? Not quite. But I have to know, why the Stewart building? A BB kid won a robotics contest against Midtown at Stewart Robotics and Engineering last year. Midtown lost. Sounds like Midtown is super bothered about it. They'll be even more bothered when we get Lance back. It looks like RJ left another note. Okay. If I want to find Lance, I'll need to shine the UV light on the mural somehow. Maybe I could re-angle these beams. Sweet. I'm sure that old box won't mind if I just give it a little love tap. Nice. Yeah. 
hidden message. I knew it. We BIPOC artists are birds of a feather. To find the next clue, all a band together. Hmm. Lost. BIPOC artist. Haley's the art expert. Let me give her a call. I heard you're looking for Lance. Did you find him? Not yet. Midtown is making us work for it. But I could use your help, sending you a pic. BIPOC artists. Birds of a feather. <clears throat> There's a bunch of BIPOC murals at Rodney and Third. Don't know what Aliband means, though. Thanks, Haley. I owe you one. That thank you was plenty. But I'm always down for coffee. You got it. Ton of murals here. Gotta be a hidden message on one of them. How are we doing? I'll find Lance soon. I think. Midtown's hidden messages on murals around town. Right now I'm at Rodney and Third, trying to find the next clue. Where Anders Oliband's painting is? <laughs> Makes sense. Oliband? Midtown mentioned him in the clue. But who is he? Evie's own premier art prodigy turned research fellow at the Musée de la Vie in Paris? Maybe Midtown's jealous they don't have an alum like that. Competition is stiff, but your tactics are stale. The greatest in the region shall soon prevail. Hey, Haley, got another clue for you. Sent a pick. Hmm. Greatest in the region. If it's about another mural, you might want to try North Williamsburg. Didn't BV and Midtown have a chess match there last week? Yes. Regional. Ended in a stalemate. Aha! That explains why Midtown's so bitter. I'll check it out. Two murals this time? Man, Midtown really doesn't want us to find Lance. Good thing Brooklyn Visions has Spider-Man on their side. they get all this equipment this setup is impressive like ridiculously impressive how do we even have time to set this up Maine, as in main street Main Street has hundreds of locations. I need more details. Wait. Why didn't the second one light up? There must be more to do. Red and blue flags. Could there be two paths? Uh. 
I guess if I have time to be Spider-Man, they've got time to set up an elaborate puzzle around the city. Must be the street number. Finally. Okay, what's it say? 1121 Main Street. That must be where they're hiding Lance. Hey, Miles. Speak on it. I think I found Lance. 1121 Main Street. Knew I could count on you. in here. Lance the Lion. Time for you to head home. One of you must be RJ. Spider-Man? No fair. Brooklyn Vision cheated. Whoa, Spider-Man? Guess BB couldn't figure it out on their own. Thanks for the fun and games. But I've got to get this guy home. Any luck? On my way back, and I'm bringing a fluffy friend. Lance, you found him. Is he okay? Did they hurt him? Looks safe and sound to me. <laughs> they I had thought him it was in a, a garage. Person. It was kind of dusty. He might need a bath. Anyway, hurry back. We're all ready for him. On my way. Back safe and just in time for the game. Ah, <laughs> oh, someone's asking their special one to homecoming, but it looks like things got out of hand. Did they overdo it like one of those gender reveal things? Sounds less dramatic than that. Yeah, you're right. Okay, on my way. Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah, I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything has to be perfect. Whoa, 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 okay, I got you. <laughs> Can you explain a little slower? What happened? <sighs> okay, I want to ask someone to homecoming, but he's special. I couldn't just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens, and Perhaps I want to light them up with the message. But the generator's busted. The guy who rented it out to me won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. Generators are going for a lot these days. This baby's ours. You understand? That's no ordinary rental transaction. You look tired. Ain't nobody stepping to me. Mess around, find out.
That takes care of these guys. I should check on the salesperson. Thanks, Spider-Man. Glad to help. Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah, about that. I'd love to deliver this thing, but those idiots already did so much damage. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Tell me some good news. Well, it's news. Generator's busted. Wait. Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. Since the generator's no good, does BB have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but they're all overpowered for my setup. We'd blow a fuse. Unless we find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shock. I've got a friend who would love that joke. Found a generator, but it's deactivated. See? That should work great. Mind giving it your special... spark? Got the voltage we need. Now we just gotta route it to the ground floor. Yes! I knew you'd figure it out. Maybe I could connect these power nodes. seems to be traveling through an old circuit. I should go into electrical engineering. Thank you a million. Oh, maybe you should call yourself the Great Electric Spider. Thanks. I like Spider-Man just fine. <laughs> oh, just got a text. He's on his way. Ah, uh, don't go just yet. I could still use your help. Just hide. Vijay's texting me. What? A whiteboard? <laughs> oh, Vijay. What are you up to? Hmm. Wait a sec. That's the equation he helped me with on our first date. Study session. Hmm. Study date? Spider-Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? <laughs> okay, looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> okay, what is this? Aw, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Oh, braces, lip balm, and all. <sighs> but still, best kiss ever. Spider-Man, the poster is stuck. Can you give it a tug? Oh! 
VJ must be in the quad. Time for the big reveal. Find a seat and grab some popcorn. VJ, this whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy, and I'm lucky you're my special guy. I love you, Lucas. Will you... Will you... Uh... Home? Ah, uh, not exactly. Oh no. Gotta be something I can do to help here. I need to use my chain lightning. Homecoming? Oh, VJ, of course. Matching sequin blazers? Hell yeah. Cool. Phew. That was close. Done. Thank you for making this possible. Holy crap. You really got Spider-Man in on this? <laughs> Best day ever. Anything for love, guys. Happy for you both. Enjoy homecoming. <laughs> Lost drone at uh, somewhere o'clock. Can't be too hard to find. Don't they have tracking chips in them? Yeah, except this one stopped responding. It might be tougher than I thought. All right, be there soon. Hey, I heard you lost a toy drone? It's lost, but it's not a toy. I was using it to gather aerial footage for my senior project. I'd look for it myself, but it lost communication at... Uh, 300 feet X and 140 feet Y. That's the Northeast building. Can you help? Our senior projects are due Friday. Oh, right. Wait, you knew that? I, uh, get around. Here are lots of things. I'm Spider-Man. Oh, okay then. So you'll look around for me? I'm on it. It must be stuck on the roof. Check the tall building on the northeast corner of campus. <laughs> that drone has to be here somewhere. Data's corrupt. Can't turn the camera on, but it's rebooting. Awesome. Thanks. Well, since you're up there, would you mind snapping a photo of campus for us? I can make that happen. We'd like a shot of the sky bridge from the rooftop. Could you take it? Pretty specific about where to take the photo. Perfect. Look at that composition and that lighting. You've really got an eye for this. Could we get a couple more? A shot from each of the other two super tall buildings around campus would do it. Okay. Get to the tall buildings, snap a couple of pics. I can do that.
great shot of the quad. Best lunch spot, hands down. The students on campus love this. Recruitment office? <laughs> Is this senior project part of this year's AV Club recruitment video? If this shot doesn't wow the new kids, I don't know what will. Okay, so next. I forgot we need to capture students in their daily life. Just... just three shots of that, and we're golden. We want to capture the eSports team, the drone club, and the greenhouse. Gee, it's like a greenhouse? An impromptu shot of ponage in action. I'm not a keeper. So. Greenhouse. That's perfect. One of my favorite thinking spots on campus. The plants make great company. Cool. Nice action shot of the drone. You capture their movements beautifully. Hey, while you've been up there, I've been tinkering with the drone. Camera's still busted, but at least it still flies. One last favor. It's the last thing we need. For real. Could we get a tour of campus in one continuous shot from the air? You can meet us up on the rooftop to start the fly-through. Alright. I'll get something nice for you.
and swings through it or glide. Either way, let's keep the shot off the ground. In the air. Got it. Here I go. Woo! This thing is fast. Thanks for working your magic. All in a day's work. That'll do it. Thanks to you, this recruitment video is really gonna shine. Don't suppose you'd be down to do 10 hours of editing for me. You better <laughs> let the master cinematographer handle that part. to come by the foundation sure i'm excited to see what you're up to great i'm excited to show you oh gotta grab this call from nj see you soon hey how you doing good just got off the phone with harry and this foundation thing could be interesting oh nice some hope on my work front too i dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer it's darpa level stuff yeah whoever's behind them has a ton of resources Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... Uh, everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. Oh, especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. these guys made.
You're kind of getting sand everywhere. Probably check out it's that crystal map. To follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco must have felt so alone during all this. His back against the wall? I can relate. It's all on all. Over here! Hey, Chief. Thanks for coming. We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. <laughs> the spider bot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. <laughs> All right. I find the people, Clark gets them out. I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Any time now. Just came in. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. One of those breathing exercises again.
who's on the way. Just try not to move. They'll have you out of here soon. Okay. Uh, thank you, Spider-Man. Looks like I need to go up. So it's field testing time for my latest upgrade. My insurance better come to this for Location I sent your way? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider Man. Leave it to me. up ahead a few minutes ago. Purple jacket. Make sure you help them. Hey, Clark. I just sent a new location your way. But this guy said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? I'm not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. Take some maneuvering. Follower of the flame. I don't recognize them. The intruder that's been skulking around. They can't stop all of us. Now keep looking for supplies. We'll need them in the days ahead. the flame i just i just wanted out then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in painfully Finish him off! 
before the police get here. Let's be sure this building is gonna fall apart before then. You think you're worthy? He's got something! That's you. Thanks. Who's this? Siri. So what's your deal? There you are. Hey. You never did like my smoking. Yuri. Low lives call me Wraith. It's pretty well, I think. I tried. Where have you been? No time. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record. And they said it couldn't be done. just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep an eye on her and the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. <laughs> you need at least eight. profile stories these days but if you have time I'd like to forward a public thank you on your show I'm a BBA senior who would never have gotten an A on their final cinematography project if it wasn't for spider-man's help I was so grateful I decided to name my new hamster after him it meant a lot that he took the time to help me given how much he's had to deal with lately sometimes the smallest good things make ripples if you read this thanks for reading sincerely Odyssey Oh, Odyssey, I love stories like this. Small things make such a difference. So, here is my challenge for all of you. Do something small today. Give a stranger a compliment, buy a friend a coffee, put a coat. Is that a good photo, Spider-Man? They sent it to the student newspaper. <laughs> The Spider-Man aren't the only superheroes in New York. Getting students to class on time? One of the greatest powers I've ever seen. Wow. I was wondering what this place was.
You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? The far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. <laughs> so the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this... Place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... She got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. Cool. Heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is. Yeah. Dr. Just Young is doing sex. this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Wait, are you serious? That data is not compatible with the AI learning I just did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. A carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Check the hive. Those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real. You'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. Whoa. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural networks, bee. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. Attention. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea.
<laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. <laughs> hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Come on, Guess I'll look around. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. <laughs> yeah, he be like, I'm not taking a risk. the results from the sample so much to see here where do i even start the origins of life on earth remain a mystery how could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue I should explore as much as I can right now. <coughs> Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. Cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Wanna feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. Oh! So cool! May would have loved this place. show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and spreads. 
The Emory May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. There's so much to explore, but I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Nice. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting-edge work is being put to use, saving lives. <coughs> Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. <laughs> Not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Love to work for a place like this. How long have you been here today? <coughs> Two hours. I gotta find a new place to rent. Okay, I've got a notebook in my building. I'm gonna find you, dude. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. Make sure you talk to HR about the report. So put your way back helmet on and think future. back. Really? Even before high school. Now I can probably camp like to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rigor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. Algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. This way, dude. Yeah. See you soon. 
Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. Oh. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Jesus, this was real. They could get the internet to do this stuff all day. work Peter <laughs> using this technology we're on track to end world hunger by 2035 Wow I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested oh very much so Harry was right you'll be a real asset here thank you dr. Foster so now where Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. <coughs> or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. <laughs> Go ahead. Swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now.
When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. Join me? God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and Nate proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later. I feel yeah. like if he tells him he's Spider-Man yeah. now, it would be, if it went for the Venom shit, he'd be alright. Researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. Hold that thought. Spider stuff. <coughs> Peter, excited to have you on board. We partnered with your friends at Feast to feed the community, starting by improving our gardens. To help, please collect some samples of nearby plants and put our gene splicer to use. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. Let's scan these vines. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. more efficient with water. I can use that. <laughs> this one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities.
Let's see. This works. These plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. Probably need to pull on that valve. Yeah, I just gotta patch this up. Webs should do the trick. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Gotta take care of. Just a few more to patch up. Hmm. Pipes blocked by that car. Productive if I drowned all the plants. May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. And we're back. So, like I was saying, let's hold that thought. Spider stuff. Does anyone have sunscreen? And will one of you do my back, please? They won't give up! Whoever they are, they definitely read up on Marco. And we're back. So, like I was saying, this new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? 
The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right, good luck out there. See any bad guys? Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge, but there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Uh, glittering? Come on, man. Take a look around. <clears throat> what do we have here? Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline, going through the city like it's an obstacle course, never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Is that a real gun? That actually works? You won! 
Don't get away. Uh -huh. no, 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 no. Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? I'll take that as a no. That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. Now, where's your boss? Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Oh, come on, Bertie. Let's go. Come on. Not buy a ticket for this ride. I'm gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, it's buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? <laughs> I want to find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta drop one of them away. fast you find something two things this armed group calls themselves hunters and they've got a lot of accents hmm international mercenaries that's what i'm thinking could be front page material for your article i'm writing it up now thanks oh and speaking of work i accepted harry's offer that's fantastic we should celebrate later after you're done with your current work totally talk soon Nice to sleep you. Yeah. 
That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Hello. <coughs> Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. <coughs> Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Genki, but he could help pinpoint these. <coughs> What's Craven hunting? And why? You hungry too? <coughs> Easy. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh, oh sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking kills operation. Good. Beetles, talandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some shipments. I'll have to pay that yardmaster a visit. But otherwise. Wait. What's this? These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. Or well connected. Or both. Would challenge Craven here. Only if they are fools. Look around. Craven has given us the greatest hunt of our lives. We were aimless at first, but yet. Truly is the land. It's him, Spider Man! to next.
Looks like this is the only way. A research lab? That's the tiara akatahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal, Ugh. Craven's studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from, or how to get them for himself. Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. Some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. I hear you were not impressed by this Scorpion. <laughs> it's not that I wasn't impressed. Relying on illusions and playing with your prey. It's just not the way. But I can still appreciate your skill. Speaking of, you take a look at what is in his poison? Hell of a cocktail. No wet. Hang on a minute. <clears throat> Down you go. Some mine outside Sound. There was a man eater who killed close to a hundred workers. Craven was young in his prime. He trapped the lion in his But when he finally got close enough to draw his blade, the lion was stronger, faster, more cunning. It was only through luck that he managed to strike a human wall. In the sensation before that moment, I know it. Craven had never been so close before. So he took that mane as a reminder. Mm. And like a bloodhound, he uses it to find killers who stink of death. <gasps> Just as much as the man eater had been a true hunter.
I was worried you knew you wouldn't have any spirit left. The perimeter is a little quiet. Status update. No response. Hunters! Another noise. Where is it coming from? Heading over now. On your feet. No one here. We've got a perimeter breach. I knew I heard something. We got another one of us. Okay. I could really use some answers instead of questions right now. Hmm. That looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't. Never gonna win best in show with that attitude. <laughs> Nice, doggy, kitty, robot. Those teeth are no joke. Actually, now 
that you're here. Question. What's Craven hunting? Maybe I can help. No joke! Control would show up. Actually, now that you're here, question what's Craven hunting? Maybe I can help. Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team.
this the best you can do? <laughs> For what? In serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. Uh, can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. I see you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. So I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion. And he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? I don't know, but this list is extensive. These must be the people Marco warned us about. They were hunting Samuel. No way. Leash is on their list, too. Black Cat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up, and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. <laughs> Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Hey, Haley, what's up? So all that help you gave folks at Brooklyn Visions, they banded together to make you a thank you gift. That's sweet. But Spider-Man can't accept gifts, unless it's hugs. Haha. -ha. Hugs are great. But I think you'll put this gift to good use. <laughs> Swing by the rooftop garden when you get a chance. That's perfect. 
perfect for Robbie. When my son was growing up, I helped coach his youth baseball team here. Every game we played, the parents talked more trash than the kids. Myself included. <clears throat> for a few black cat safe houses. Head into the first one now. Thanks for offering to do this. He can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. <laughs> it's cool. I always have time to Spider-Man. Sounds like you're as good at work-life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my Hunter story. Might save my job. But you guys, with what happened to Scorpion, and me and the wind, <coughs> Can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. It might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. Uh, I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but... C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it, it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I... We're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, <coughs> right? We'll find him. I know. Thanks, MJ. And Miles, be careful with Felicia. You can't trust her, no matter what she says. Warn her about the hunters and get her out of the city. Understood. Let you know when I get there. That's good. I mean, if I was rich, I'd take advantage of that backdrop, too. I'd also be worried about constantly launching balls off the roof, but I guess they can afford it. about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? Cool. What do they do? Well, big picture, it's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, AKA apiologist, Dr. M. Young. They're the foremost expert on colony collapse disorder and a pretty sick ukulele player, if you happen to follow them on the socials. So, young Osborne, your foundation has a lot of work to do repairing your father's legacy. But, so far, you're off to a good start. Don't forget to pay your rent on the first, or, you know, withhold your check in protest. Whatever, do you. Later. What do we got? Place looks like it was ransacked. Perfect chance to use the AR tech Genki upgraded. Some red flags. Hmm. Any sign of her? Found some scratch marks with traces of metal. I'll run it to see if it matches her claws. <coughs> Just have to isolate the molecular components of the metal filings I found. Okay. Uh, whoops. Nice. <coughs> Titanium. What else? Let's see here. Done. Cobalt. This is looking good. Who says science isn't fun?
got it. <coughs> Tungsten. A match. Did it. It's her. Scuff marks from her shoes. She must have been hustling. She was grabbing something from that box on the wall. Looks like an emergency stash box. But it's empty. Hunters. That should be enough to reconstruct the scene. They attacked. But she's on the run. They're already on to her. This is exactly why the city needs to be warned about the hunters. She could have... Keep me posted. Whoa! That's gotta be her! Well, this went from a friendly warning to a rescue mission pretty quick. I just hope I'm not too late. Felicia's resourceful, but everything we've seen from these hunters has me kind of worried. You're worried about your boyfriend's ex? That's compassion. Looks like I just missed them. Any signs of where they went? Let me scan the area and see. They must be behind there. An electrical node. I bet there's more. Another node down. Another stash box. This one's still locked. She risked her whole life to get to it. Gotta open it, but the power's disconnected. Bet the generator could power that stash box. If I tether my web to the generator, I can get into the box. This looks right. Nearly there. That did it. I'm in. <coughs> Paris. MJ, how's your French? Non-existent. But send me what you got. Okay. There's some instruction manual for a Wanda Watoon. Watoon? Hmm. I'll do a search. Give me a sec. Hunters. Wherever they're headed, I should follow. According to a translation of the Mystic Arcana, that wand is old. We're talking BC old. Supposedly, whoever wields it can create portals to pretty much... Wherever they can think of. Like magic? If she gets her hands on something like that. I can think of some uses for it. Miles, let's just stick to the plan. <coughs> We're in position. She's ours. <laughs> Oh shit. She's definitely inside. Got to clear these hunters out. She's doing it with us. Whatever that wand does. It does it brightly. She's a sentient centaur. <laughs> Black cat's doing magic in there, or I'm missing out on a hell of a rave.
Translates to my reason for living. Time is short. Hmm. A new partner? Alicia? You never know. <laughs> the last of them. Now let's see what's up with Felicia. Spider wants to play, huh? Why don't you help me stop this guy? You're Spider-Man. You've saved the city before. You'll do it again. Spider-Man was right about you. You only care about yourself. Look, kid. Not that it's your business. My girlfriend's in Paris. And I got her into trouble with some bad people. 
you ever done something for love? She needs me now. If only I could figure out how to go more than ten feet with this thing. MJ said not to trust you. <gasps> Red's a smart one. But you gotta make your own choices, kid. <laughs> Take her alive! She's mine! You should go! Portal out of here! The instruction manual for this artifact was not clear! You seem to be getting better at it! Not better enough! We're gonna figure it out! Together! Damn! Lucky attitude, kid! Spider-Man! Not kid, thank you! Alright, Spider-Man! Let's see what you've got!
Over here! They never saw you coming! Locked on! Here. Focus. Think Eiffel Tower. How are we, Felicia? She's safe, for now. You finished your story? Just sent it to Jonah. Wish me luck. You got this. You, head to Coney Island. What? What's up? You know how Mysterio just got out of prison? Well, he's opening a new attraction there. He could be the hunter's next target. Good call. And guess who else is at Coney tonight? Hint, you crushed on her for like over a year. Come on, bro. Don't bro me, bro. You and Haley are made for each other. If you don't ask her out, you're violating laws of nature. We'll see after we check on Mysterio.
I'd love to see you all. Hey, you pay for that photo, Spider-Man? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I heard this guy dips his hot dog buns in tomato juice before eating them. Now, I get that it makes it easy for them to go down, but tomato juice? Brother, that ain't right. <laughs> Gotta change it to Miles first. Then I'll scope out the park. Incognito. I don't see any bad guys. Hmm. And should we take a closer look? Hello. I'm Quentin Beck, master illusionist. And this is Betsy, my business partner, and Cole, my technical advisor. And this... is the next generation of entertainment. <laughs> no way, dude. <sighs> Excellent. Cool. A brave young man, ready to experience the future firsthand. Is there anyone else out there with courage in their hearts? Come, come on, Genki. And experience the future. There's a kiosk up ahead. Just keep moving. If you enjoy your experience, please tell your friends and feel free to visit one of the many mysteriums now open around the city. Our free trial ends soon. Thank you, Betsy. I'm sure you will. to customize your experience. It's a holo deck. As you look at these images, I want you to think about your future, your hopes and your dreams. Ah, yes. I'm getting good data. And we're done. No way. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Don't worry, I'll be watching and listening. If at any time you begin to feel uncomfortable, just let us know. Enjoy your dream come true. All right, let's get it.
me up some! Try this. not hurt? I can hold my own, but can't you just pull the plug or something? It's not that easy, but we are trying. Wicked. <laughs> Beck said this was my custom dream come true. Maybe more like a nightmare. Get to it. Fast. I think if you finish the song, you might hit a break point in the program. There. You should see an exit. Make your way to the... Okay. Time to go. Are you okay? 
Yeah. I am very sorry. We will do our best to find out what happened. Until then. I mean, it's a pretty cool concept, that's for sure. Miles! So, uh, what's up with that? Oh. <laughs> uh, the future of entertainment still has some bugs to work out. Hi, Pete. <laughs> Cool shirt. Cool shoes. And really cool shoes. Cool everything, really. Hey, Miles. Thank you. Hey, guys, this is my best friend, Harry. Uh, he just got back from overseas, and he's starting up a new research foundation. You mean we're starting up a new research foundation? <laughs> hey, good to meet you. Uh, new job, huh? Still gonna have time for tutoring? We'll figure it out. Shall we? Uh, actually... That thing back there really messed my head up. Can we dip? Okay. Nice meeting you, Harry. Yeah, you too. You, you good? Yeah. Actually, uh, I'll catch up with you later. Hey, we should really check it on Miles. Make sure he's okay. Yeah, I will. Okay. Well, they seem nice. And too bad they're gonna miss out on the best night of our lives, huh? <laughs> All right, here's the plan. Tonight is the greatest hits album of our childhood. And the top three singles, each of our favorite attractions. Welcome! All right, let's do this. Step right up. You have no idea who you're up against. <laughs> Good luck. You'll meet it. Now, Pete, you got this. All right, players. On the trigger, Let's guys go. on the target. And they're off. The great Coney Island Open returns after three years, and our returning competitors seem to be in the highest of spirits. Harry, what are you doing? Distracting you. Duh. Working. Oh, that's dirty. Go, Pete! You're taking his side? I don't root for cheaters. Ooh, burn! And our returning champion keeps his crown! <laughs> Hold up! You guys want your prize? Oh, we're good, thanks. I look good in the crown. Next on our top three, MJ Watson featuring the Speed Demon. Ooh, yes! Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. This one looks fun. How did I let you talk me into this? Ah, stop and smell the popcorn. How can you think about food right now? You know me, I have many talents. Sure. With the spinning vertigo ride out of the way. <laughs> Forgot how much I loved that one. So. Ooh, yes. Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. If we do enough of them, we can win something from the prize booth. Oh, I knew I read that somewhere. Oh, you want to play some hoops? God, I hope the speed demon is as terrifying as I remember. Swish, swish, fish. Never knew you were so into basketball, Harry. With all this energy I've had lately, I'm into everything. Yes! Show him how it's done, Pete! Yeah, let's go! Another stamp for our ticket. Excuse me. Dolphin racing? Maybe some other time. Knock him down is calling our name. Throw the ball and knock him down. The baby could do it. I've heard pyramids are the most stable structure. Let's test that out. I know somebody who blew 20 bucks trying to knock him down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not 
supposed to be able to do that. <laughs> Another one's gone. No, don't ask for reason yourself. Ready to put our love to the test? Your boss can't retaliate if you together. Okay, you two go get declared soulmates. I'm gonna fly solo. See if I give off Casanova vibes. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> soulmates, huh? No pressure. What does this thing know about us? Maybe that you should move in with me? Or maybe that everything's too up in the air to think about it yet? Yeah, maybe. Whoa, that can't be right. What is this thing reading anyway? Our body temperature? <laughs> or our skin's pH? Highly doubt it's that sophisticated. Over here, let's do this one next. Just three left. Go karts, anyone? <laughs> With your driving? Hard pass. Come on, you two lovebirds. Got more park to explore. doing here looks like he's a mechanic and saving the day <laughs> thanks for pulling me out man that could have been really bad maybe we should try the roller coaster <laughs> Park really is a magnet for reformed supervillains. <laughs> yeah. Come on, we still have a little more memory lane to walk down. If I get whiplash, I'm good with this place. What is that? Somebody threw something. Oh, oh. Guess we can't go through this way. Clean up, pile. This pile. <laughs> Come on, let's try and sit up front. <coughs> After you. <laughs> Such a gentleman. You doing okay? I'm really nervous. Don't worry about it. Chances the person Harry gave his prize to would be the single rider sitting next to him. I mean, it would be one heck of a meet cute. Should we tell her? Tell her what? What are you two whispering about up there? Just reminding MJ to keep her hands inside the vehicle at all times. <laughs> Bell, but the dream always kept me coming back. I think this will be the year. <laughs> Sorry.
How's it feel? Weirdly high. Or do you mean being as handsome? This charm? Being Peter. Being Peter is nice. I think we could both use more nights like this. Yeah. I always say we will, but... Let's pinky promise this time. Just not right now. Too high. All right. Postponed pinky promise. Huh, needed that. So relaxing up there. <laughs> Two more. I know we promised no real-life talk, but I need one hall pass. MJ, you have to come by EMF. You can check out Pete's new office. Ugh, I know, I have to. But I've been so busy trying to impress Jonah. Her boss. Wait, but Jonah Jameson? Slimy shock jock Jonah? Who's telling you what to do? Uh, only if I want to stay employed. You really did need a night out. I think I'll go see if that claw machine is still finessable like old times. You two coming? We'll catch up in a sec. Glad he's doing what he loves. Killing it at the claw machine? I met the foundation. It's great that he gets to make a living helping people. I'll bet your book helped more people than you realize. Always looking on the bright side, huh? Better than the alternative. I don't believe it. Claw Machine has a new high score. Couldn't beat it. Tragic. Getting real hungry myself. Okay? Yeah. On your left. I just want to chill for a bit. I don't think I've been back here in like six years. Good night, huh? Perfect weather, smell of hot dogs, people laughing. Look, you can kind of even see the stars up there. Pretty sure that's a plane. It is nice. Now that you mention it, you don't get out enough. Well, hey, now that I'm back, it can be like old times. Just the three of us painting the town... something. You know this. Red. Red. <laughs> Sorry, my head's all over the place. <sighs> I know I'm right about those stars. <laughs> <laughs> this could be a good one. <laughs> hey, Pete. This is the best night of my life. Hey, Harry. Me too. <laughs> I want to have my birthday here this year. I didn't think I'd get any more of those. There will be plenty, buddy. <laughs> Fuck, they're going to kill him off in this one, aren't they? That was great. <sighs> what a ride. One left in its prize city. <laughs> Your secret admirer one. <laughs> Who, Jonah? Nothing. Not a word on my article yet. Still can't believe he's your boss. Let's just find something to hit. This thing's a token. There's literally no way to win. All right. New strategy. I know. I told him the same thing. Go for it. All right, little hydras, come out, come out wherever you are. Dude, that's kind of dark. Gotcha! What? They're not pigs. I can't exactly threaten to blow their houses down. Have you ever considered, like, I don't know, not dropping sass? I have not, thank you very much. Yes! Take that, you stupid hydra! Yo, MJ, you good? Great! Thanks! Yeah, MJ, show those hydras who has opposable thumbs. Jesus. Oh, I really needed that. So, whose face were you picturing? On the moles? Classic transference. It was totally Jonah's, was it? That's everything. Hey, there's a prize with our name on it. Oh, on your right.
Pete. Good, Pete. Who's up first? You know Pete, I'm never taking this off, right? You're gonna wear that to the office. Co-founder approved. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Take it easy, Harry. Don't hurt yourself. The only thing that's gonna hurt is your Parker pride. Boys, boys. You're both pretty. Uh, sorry. What? Um, okay. Uh, I guess this really was the year. Harry, that was something else. Yeah, I have no idea how I did that. Okay, how about we do something more chill? Looks like the Ferris wheel line has died down some. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna let you two go ahead and be cute together. I'm gonna <coughs> go see if I can win a couple more unicorns. Funny, Harry's getting a second chance, but I feel like I'm getting one too. You two are gonna make a hell of a team. <laughs> the Bugle posted. Did Jonah put you on the front page? Oh, you're gonna be an editor. I should have brought champagne. Hunters and scorpions and explosions, oh my. Jonah posted the new guy story. Oh, MJ, uh, yeah. It already has 5,000 views. <sighs> I've got to write a different kind of story. Win his trust, somehow. Fuck that. Hey, I'll come up with something. You always do. And, hey, if you need some help from your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, I'd say we make a hell of a team, too. Even if I do forget the champagne. Next time. his phone. I've got my hands full with these hunters, and I don't see him anywhere. Our Ferris wheel pot is about to touch down. I'll make sure he's safe. And you stay safe, too. <laughs> you know I don't go anywhere without my Simkarian sightings. Is that what you call your sable stingray? Still workshopping it. I'll let you know when I find Harry. 
in on the raceway that's where tombstone was working he's tough so are these guys hunter start your engines and may the best fighter win spider-man Tombstone. Thanks for the tip. Yeah. I'll keep looking for Harry. He's running out of my laptop. I mean, on my not laptop, my um phone. MJ, found Harry? Not yet, but I saw Mysterio. Craven's Goon Squad doesn't seem to be interested in it, like at all. And they must only want Tombstone. Thanks for the tip. Yeah, I'll keep looking for Harry. <laughs>
Bombs are no joke! Get rid of these fights! Tombstone, you just worry about breaking through that net. You thought I had to see the day you defend me. You and me both, Lonnie. But these guys, his boss wants you dead. He's a hunter, and he's making super villains his prey. Yes, and he's not open to a call for my parole officer. Not how I turn my life around. Since he's already killed Scorpion, probably not. <laughs>
these guys, Tombstone. You just worry about breaking through that net. He's a date. You and me both, Lonnie. But these guys, his boss wants you dead. He's a hunter, and he's making super villains his prey. Guessing he's not open to a call from my parole officer about how I turned my life around. Since he's already killed Scorpion? Probably not. <laughs> Sorry, Lonnie. I really do want to help you.
Cool. Well, I guess he doesn't have to explain why he can't work <laughs> well. Was that? Yeah. Hey, my dude. Shit. things coming out of you I think it's my treatment dr. Connor said it's some kind of self-learning exosuit but I had no idea it could wait you know what this means right we both have superpowers just think about all the stuff we could do to heal the world Sorry, I uh, <laughs> guess I still got to figure out how this thing works. Well, it's a real shame neither of us has a state-of-the-art science lab to run some tests. I'll go make sure the coast is clear. Meet you there. Give me a call when you're ready. He's been... One sec. These wind turbines are tiny but mighty. Once deployed on high altitude currents, they are a potentially self-sustaining source of clean power. Eventually, they'll shuttle back and forth to a dock. But right now, we're looking for a way to place these for an initial test run. I think I can get these up to the right altitude with the web wings. They don't call it Brooklyn Heights for nothing. lift. I need a little push. The intersection of Court and Montague is super windy. I've certainly lost enough papers walking through there. Let's use that as a natural wind tunnel. This is really high. How can such tiny turbines create so much energy? wind is a power source with these just imagine now to deploy fly free little turbine kabam one more there we go great they're all happily launched i'll just head back the turbine's been compromised what how need to check on that Gotta get up there. Talon drones attacking the turbine. I've gotta stop them. meeting like 
Get this! They have our way, and we won't have to! Oh, really? I'm in your way? <laughs> You're the guys that are raiding the city and causing chaos. back in place. There. All up and running. I should make sure Dr. Wynn sets up some turbine security for these. Hey, I just saw what happened at Coney. What was that? Well, uh... Remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly, no idea. I think it's this treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> swing by. Man, how many times have you said that in minute, literally? Building it in 1901? Finished in 1909. I thought it was old when I was a kid, but now it's just amazing the history that's in this city. for peace have been rejected by calls for violence from you know it spider-man an attack on what was once a destination for enjoyment now stands desecrated and defiled our cherished coney island was victim to a free-for-all brawl destroying iconic attractions and history itself some of my fondest memories were in coney island my father used to buy me the nickel pop and hot dog combo, and I, like any self-respecting American, would overindulge. Now, it's all been taken from me. To make matters worse, Spider-Man seems to have brought a new friend along for his night on the town. Just what this city needs. Another vigilante to take the law into their own hands. One person wasn't enough for you to corrupt, Spider-Man. You need two acolytes to do your bidding. Add to the pile of unpleasantness, the hunters and reformed criminal Lonnie Lincoln, a.k.a. Tombstone, and you have a recipe for the ruination of any normal person just trying to have a night out. These hunters are clearly after the Spider-Man and any of their accomplices. They're as much a blight on this city as the heroes protecting it. I'm sure old glory Mayor Grant loves what this does for tourism. You guys 
be in an hourglass or something. Gotta get that sand crystal. Now. You are still breaking the law. They're circling me, Miha. Oh, wishing I just stayed home with you, came here. Helped you with your homework. Made you the one meal that I know how to cook. But it's too late now. The hunters were after him. Marco fell right into their trap. But wait, Kimia's his kid? How did I not know about this? Just check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving. Making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. Hey, Pete! Watch this! Uh... Woo! Oh! Oh. You okay? Come on. Let's see what else this thing can do. What are you doing? Science, buddy. I'm doing science. <laughs> so... Spider-Man? You told MJ, but not your best friend? To protect you. I, I wanted to. Right. Yeah, I get it. And that kid you're tutoring, he's the other one? Uh, a lot happened while you were in that tank. Trust me. I know. <laughs> nice and gentle. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make some coffee. It looks like it's gonna be a long night. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Dude, they're gonna trash the office. Oh, God. What the hell happened here? Um, we were we were just um, doing some experiments. Where's Doctor Connors? Uh, maybe he took the day off. No, he doesn't take days off. I'm gonna go. Yeah. Yeah, I'll call you later. Nice. <laughs> How the hell is he gonna explain that? Harry's got superpowers? This is all happening so fast. Wait, what's that? Hey guys, I'm getting a strange spider bot signal. You got that too? Uh, Genki, 
You testing something? I was just about to call you guys. A bunch of them just pinged the network out of nowhere. They're using some funky wireless protocols. I'll check it out and let you know what I find. Sharp. Uploading info to the Spidey server. Got it. I'll keep an eye out for more. Send me the data when you find them. I'll try to track down who made them. <laughs> We've got a time traveler. Hey, long night. Hey, MJ. Harry and I stayed up doing tests on his suit. And we may have had too much pizza. It was really nice. <laughs> Just like the good old days. So I gotta know, what's Harry's radioactive spider? I've never seen anything like this before. It's some kind of exosuit that completely eradicates any trace of his disease. Dr. Connors really outdid himself this time. That's incredible. And great timing, considering oh. what happened at the park. Any leads on where they might have taken Tombstone? Not yet. But if I hear anything, you're my first call. Oh, you're the best. Yeah, I know. Okay, what's next? They still haven't figured out who made that weird spider bot. One sec. Oh no. Looks like someone lost their grandpa at Prospect Park. bad. You know, I saw an old grandmaster playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Damn. Never seen anything like it. Hey, Yuri. I tracked the followers of the flame to an abandoned clinic in Chinatown. If we go together, maybe we'll find their boss. So you can leave them to die, too? Not unless I have to. Look, this cult needs to be stopped. You want to come along, it'd make things easier. But I don't need you. If I went, I could keep an eye on her.
If you weren't a robot, you'd definitely be venomous. Hey, spiders. Got something for you. Head to this location. Felicia? Hey, Felicia. Heard some chatter about the steel foundry in Williamsburg off a radio I swiped from those hunters. Sounds like tombstones there. He could use your help. Thanks. Glad you're all right. Did you make it to Paris in time? Yeah, I did. Figured I owed you one. Both of you. Even if the other Spider-Man couldn't be bothered to make an appearance. Uh, yeah. Uh, about... You can the... save the explanation. We've both moved on. He's a good one, by the way. He really is. Well, thanks for the tip. I'm not sure I'd be able to find Tombstone in time without you. Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself. Those fashion school rejects won't be getting the drop on me again. Ta-ta, spiders. Miles, let me take this one. You're gonna miss your essay deadline. What if... If Lee's there, I'll take care of him. Spider-Man can wait. Miles can't. All right. Just keep in touch. I hope Felicia's lead was right. Gotta get to Tombstone before Craven crosses him off his list, too. Spider-Man, thank you for coming. I'm looking for my Grandpa Earl. He kept talking about meeting someone here, and now he's gone, and... Can you please help me find him? Any clues on where he might be? Just this picture. He was staring at it all morning. Oh, this looks familiar. Some kind of exhibit. Looks like this was taken 60 years ago. Around the same time of year, too. I'll find him. Don't worry. Please hurry. He gets confused, and I just don't want him to get scared or hurt or... <laughs> Looked like there's some kind of animal enclosure in the picture. This is the place, but no grandpa. Let's see. Did you leave any hints behind? Oh. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Someone put a flower arrangement by the sea lion pool. And what's that? Is that his note? Yep, addressed to the man himself. Hey, he's not at the zoo, but I found a note addressed to him that says something about a botanical garden. My grandparents used to take weekend walks through the botanical gardens. That has to be where he is. <laughs> bench. If that's Grandpa Earl's, he's definitely got style. This is Grandpa's inhaler. He probably needs it. The substance analyzer should do the trick. If I isolate the compound, maybe I can create a trail that will lead to Grandpa. Let's see here. <gasps> it's the time of the year when the weather is just right. Okay. Got it. 
Hey, he isn't at the gardens either. But I found his inhaler and was able to science my way into creating a trail I can follow. I'll let you know when I find him. Oh no, really? Please hurry, he needs that thing like he needs lungs. <sighs> Lately I've been so busy. Sometimes taking care of him felt like a thing I had to do. But the thought of losing him... All I want is to sit with him. What's wrong with me? Don't be so hard on yourself. It's hard to balance your own personal life with other responsibilities. Believe me, I know. We all do what we can. I found your grandpa by the lake. I'll sit with him until you get here. You did? I'm on my way. Stay right there. Hey there, sir. Spider-Man? Whatever you think I did, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> your granddaughter asked me to find you. Granddaughter? Huh. Well, tell her I'll be back in a minute. I propose to my wife here. Right here, where we sit. Wow, really? I have to ask, how did you propose? First off, we had to go to the zoo. Never met a soul who loved animals more than that woman. I was terrified. I meant to ask her at the meerkats. <laughs> she said they reminded her of me. But my knees were knocking, man. I couldn't see straight. We left the zoo and just kept walking. Ended up here. She... <laughs> if you saw her, man, just perfect. But clumsy. Nearly fell into that pond there. <laughs> Face first. You ever been in love, Spider-Man? Yeah. Yeah, I have. It's beautiful. Nothing more beautiful. Can I tell you something, Spider-Man? I know I'm faded. It's scary as hell. Thought I'd be ready, but nothing gets you ready. Nothing. When I'm here, it's like she is too. Like I'm living it all over again. All nervous and sweating and whatnot. Then I look into her eyes and it's like I'm home. I was so nervous that day, Spider-Man. Almost didn't even ask. It's like I blinked. And she's gone. I'm sorry. You said my granddaughter was looking for me? Let's go see her. I should have guessed you'd come here. Sorry we lost track of each other. It was my fault for wandering off. But Spider-Man took good care of me. Had a nice chat about your grandma. Oh, yeah? She used to love this spot, huh? I feel like I spent every weekend here with her, feeding the ducks. I know. She was always saying, Tasha.
If the reports coming in from Brooklyn are to be believed, these Spider-Men have grown more powerful than we feared. Magic portals, subway cars disappearing off the tracks, fire engines flying through the night sky, and the newer Spider-Man at the center. Wedding and property damage weren't enough. Now we add mystical arts into the mix. Does their desire for destruction know no bounds? I almost feel sorry for this lost soul. Groomed for a life of criminality and degradation. Speaking, it seems Spider-Man was cohorting with Notorious Thief, the Black Cat. Their costumes must be cut from the same corrupt cloth. If their entanglement doesn't paint a clear enough picture of Spider-Man's intent, then here's a little story. Hey, need a dance partner? to keep up with you. <laughs> I should probably hop off and make dinner because not only my bloody starving. It's also about to time. gonna leave it there um i'm gonna go make and eat my dinner before i go insane um and i will be back on afterwards so yeah till then see you later bye